Yes, dear friends, let's be truthful to ourselves. The truth you told yourself is the best truth. We have taught people about critical thinking and the ability to reason. We have also taught people about recycling. Going back to dustbin and make sure you recycle the dustbin. Meaning, anybody who has made a mistake one way and the another. Today, this little message is for Rafa Wazurike. Dear friends, analyzing one of the last interviews of Chief Rafa Wazurike consigning Mazi Namdekano. If you go down, you will understand that Owazurike is regretting or he regretted of maltreating Mazen Namdekano, nakeding him and allowing women to urinate on his head. How do I come to this? Owazurike when he found out that Nam de Kano is the long awaited Messiah, Owazrika said, It is quite true that he did not give us Biafra. But he has been able to produce someone whom you people loved. And he has been able to produce someone whom all the hope is upon. He has been able to produce someone who will give us Biafra with every truth and honesty. Owazurike is regretting heavily of ever maltreating Mazen Namdekano. But let us take advantage, learning from the power of Simon Eba. If Simon Eba could not stand strong, to defend himself on all the allegations they are laying on him. Nobody would be here today at this very date speaking about Biafra and then Nam Kano again. I think today's date, today's date is 30th of October. Today's date is 30th of October. Count down to enter Biafra. 126 days to enter Biafra. Let us begin to take advantage of those people who know how to make history. And they let us learn how to stand attack when we are trying to make history. We stood all the attack when every other person, we are attacking Mazen Namdekano. We defended him. When they said that he is trying to rule Owazurike, why did he go out of Masob? And we defended Namdekano until even Owazurike is defending him today. Today, we have defended Simon Neba with every proof that nobody is sending attack on us today. Now we are moving to that to Biafra in 126 days. Let us take advantage of wisdom. Let us take advantage of those people living in diaspora because Biafra is coming from diaspora. International idea is what we are bringing to rescue you in Nigeria because we know law. We know our rights. We know that what we are doing is right. Owazurike, who based in Nigeria but studied in India, he didn't understand this thing. But Owazurike is now learning from those people in diaspora. Now Owazurike can stand his feet to tell Nigerian government that only the notice from the court in Abuja telling them to liberate Mazen Nam the Kano, discharged and acquitted. <clears throat> only with this, it is enough for them to liberate him because only for this reason, hearing the news 
that there have been joy and the mighty joy in Igbo land. And if all what we are looking for is to have joy, why are you still keeping him? Keeping him there is keeping our joy. Try to reason deep. Those of you who still have their ammunition against Chief Rafa Wazurike should back it down because we are teaching recycling, recycler, going back to dustbin and recycle every other thing that is inside dustbin. Those chaffs that fall out of the wheat when it's been shaken, there are some wheat also that fall. There are some that will fall and there are some dustbin that is necessary to be recycled. This is spiritual message from 555 Vision. As you subscribe to our YouTube channel, 555 Vision, Biafran Gospel and the Bible. We are noting everything that is happening. Whenever you realize your mistake, try to remove shame out of your body and return. Return and make history for yourself. Do not let yourself die in shame by going to grave, trying to punish someone you know you cannot punish. Wazrike is regretting. King Wa Solomon placed apology. Rafa Jere placed apology. If you have not done so, sorry seems to be the hardest word, but sorry is a good. Thank you from 555 Vision.